all rough cut to nine inches long. Next step is to cut them down to width, to cut off the rough sawn edges on all of them. Then we're gonna resaw the really fat ones. Then we'll do the first big lamination. But for some reason, I just hate myself so much, I decided this wasn't enough. The original plan was to make 100 pencils, but uh, we're gonna add a digit to that number. all these pieces again son of a bitch itch 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 hey you feel better now no i don't feel better inch by three eighths by eight inches long. I'm going to resaw these right now into half inch slices and then I'll cut all those slices up into three eighth inch sticks. And then we will figure out the next step when we get there. Welcome to Jackman Works. <laughs> Pencil blanks. So in this box I have a bunch of the random pixelated pencil blanks that you've seen already. Some solid pencil blanks, which will be one color and two tone. And I have these blanks here that I cut at an angle from a larger sheet to hopefully create a cool visual with the final pencil. It's pretty tricky because it's a very small canvas to work with, but I think that we're on to something. Next step is to cut a groove in both the top and the bottom face with a eighth inch round nose router bit. Every blank will then be ripped down the middle, flipped around with a piece of lead sandwiched in between, and they will be glued together to create the final pencil blanks. Then we can make some pencils.
there's a hundred of them. So what do pencils have to do with Carolina's shoe? Nothing. Has it ever stopped me? Nope. Huge thanks to Carolina Shoe for supporting what I do by supporting my feet. I didn't even like that one. They make long lasting quality work boots that I wear literally every day. The Amp Style are my favorite around the wood shop. They're just super comfortable on a concrete slab and they're made in the US. And you can get your own pair of Carolina boots at the link down below. First hundred people will get one of these free artisan handcrafted palette wood pencils made by me. Now that link down below is to Super Casuals. It's one of the many retail stores across the US that sell Carolina boots. I actually did a pencil making demo there in the store last month. Riveting, I know. Also, many different styles of Carolina boots are currently discounted on the Super Casual site. So take this opportunity to snag a great deal along with a gift with purchase while supplies last. Oh, and the jig. The pencil making jig is something that was created by Andy Klein. I'll provide a link down below if you'd like to grab one of those, make some pencils for yourself. He also sells the lead that I use in these pencils, colored pencil lead, and also end caps and erasers that I haven't got my hands on yet, but I will soon. So keep an eye on my Instagram feed to see what that's all about. And that is it for this one. Thank you for watching. I'm gonna go ahead and wrap up the rest of these. Why do I do this to myself? <laughs>